First song that comes to mind that makes me think of my childhood is a song by James Taylor called Something in the Way She Moves. The way she moves or looks my way or calls my name It's very nice and pleasant. It's one of my favorite songs to this day. The first pop song I learned to play on the piano was Hit Me Baby One More Time by Britney Spears. The best song to sum up my teenage years maybe Gives You Hell by the All-American Rejects. That's the song that kind of describes teenage angst. My walkout song, if I were to play a sport, would probably be like Salt Shaker by Ying Yang Twins and Lil John. Because the song is phenomenal. One song that really inspired me, I, re I remember per the first album I ever purchased was the Marshall Matters LP, and there's a record with. Uh, he went by Big Snoop Dogg at the time called Bitch Please. She got some lick for me. Worth about 200 G's and 30 keys. Now check this out, Dre. Now if I don't move. And I love the snare drum that Dre would put in it. It was very in your face. And I didn't know who Dr. Dre was at the time, but I realized that he had produced a lot of records of during that time, that, that small little time period of where the snares were really loud, like in the club and, and Family Affair by Mary J. Blige. Um, so it was one of the reasons why I actually bought the Triton keyboard and wanted to recreate music like he produced it. One song of mine that I want to tell the world about right now would not be one song, it would be an entire body of work. The album Charlie, out now.